Imagine a future where our AI doesn't just live on Earth, but orbits above it, powered directly by the sun itself. Sounds like sci-fi, right? Well, that future just got a lot closer. Google, Elon Musk, and Jeff Bezos are all racing to build data centers in outer space, which could completely change how artificial intelligence is powered, trained, and scaled forever. So here's the deal, Google just announced Project Suncatcher, an experimental program aiming to build machine learning compute systems in space. CEO Sundar Pichai himself announced that Google's TPUs, their super-powerful AI chips, are headed to space. Inspired by Google's Moonshots, this project explores how solar power from space could feed entire AI systems directly, without depending on Earth's limited energy grid. Think about it, the sun gives off more power in one second than humanity has used in our entire history. If you can tap even a fraction of that, you could run AI models beyond anything we've imagined. Google's researchers recently released a deep dive into how this might work, proposing modular satellites hosting racks of AI compute hardware in orbit. These satellites would be powered by massive solar arrays and cooled using the freezing vacuum of space, eliminating energy bills, overheating, and land use. Data would be beamed back to Earth through high-speed laser communications, creating an entire off-world cloud network. It's not just efficient, it's potentially revolutionary for how we think about sustainable AI infrastructure. But Google isn't alone up there. Elon Musk just chimed in, saying SpaceX will definitely be doing this. SpaceX already runs Starlink, a massive network of over 6,000 satellites providing internet across the globe. Imagine turning that same network into a backbone for AI computing, with orbital data centers connected to Earth via laser links. Musk hinted that future versions of Starlink satellites could carry AI processing units on board, letting models train and run in low Earth orbit. It's like the Internet of Space, but with AI brains built in. And then, of course, there's Jeff Bezos. Amazon's founder has also thrown his hat in the ring, saying data centers in space are absolutely possible. Through his company Blue Origin, Bezos has been exploring how to move heavy industries off Earth, keeping our planet more livable. They're studying how to deploy large-scale compute systems beyond the atmosphere, powered by solar farms and built using robotic assembly in orbit. Bezos has long talked about a vision where Earth becomes a residential zone while manufacturing and tech infrastructure move into space. This could be the first real step toward that. Now, why are all these billionaires suddenly obsessed with space-based computing? The answer is pretty simple, Earth is running out of energy and cooling capacity for AI. Every time we build bigger models, like GPT-style systems or massive multimodal ash, we need exponentially more power and land. Current data centers already consume entire city grids worth of electricity. But space flips the equation, unlimited sunlight, zero cooling costs, and no NIMBY protests about local power drains or heat emissions. It's the ultimate sandbox for scaling AI safely and sustainably. Still, there are big challenges. Launching tons of heavy compute hardware into orbit isn't cheap, even with reusable rockets. There's also the question of maintenance, if a module fails, you can't exactly send a technician up there overnight. And then there's the issue of latency and communication delays between Earth and orbital servers. Google's research paper actually breaks down some of these problems and proposes partial solutions, like using AI systems in orbit for specific high-intensity tasks while keeping user-facing workloads on Earth. So, it's not all fantasy. They're actively testing components of this idea. But one thing's clear, we're entering a new frontier. A few years ago, AI lived in cloud servers. Today, it's being embedded in phones, cars, and homes. And tomorrow, it could be orbiting our planet, running 24-7 under the unfiltered power of the sun. Whether it's Google's Suncatcher, Musk's orbital AI networks, or Bezos' space industries, the race to bring intelligence to the stars has officially begun. And who knows, maybe one day, the first true artificial general intelligence won't be born in a lab, but in the silence of space, watching over us from above. Hit follow to stay up to date. Thanks for watching.